Why are you staring at the ram on my steering wheel? And you must be really bored. I tell you, let me tell you something about boring. Um, right now I'm here at AB Mori, Greenville, Texas, and uh, I uh, got a guy over here looking at me. I don't know why he's looking at me. How's it going? He's just staring at me. I don't know why. Probably because I've got a camera pointed at myself. Um, no, I, uh, he just keeps staring. <laughs> I don't even know what his image is. He keeps staring. So, I'm on break right now. It's 11 o'clock. I'm on break. I'm going to hold you right there. Maybe he won't say something much for that. Got my hand on it. Oh, all this dude is, he got all in the truck and just started staring at me. Uh, I don't know what he's doing, like, bum. <laughs> it's funny. Uh, anyway, so I'm out here, I'm on break. I, uh, talk about being bored. This place, there's not much work to be done, <laughs> not much work to doing. So, uh, I, uh, Second bags of first I thought flour. Uh, the first things that we were stacking is me that and the guy that actually worked with at Texas Book Company. I don't know his name. Uh, but we were stacking calcium propanate. Propanate. something. They call it calc pro. <laughs> it's a calcium propionate. Uh, so I. Uh, I was helping stack that. This, he's over on the other side now, staring at me. I, I kind of want to back out and turn the band around. I don't want him looking at me. Uh, he's got everybody else now looking at me. And I'm just sitting in my van, not doing anything. I'm on my brakes. I was told I could go outside. Apparently, talking to yourself in a vehicle is odd around these parts, I guess. Although, Technically speaking, I could just be on speakerphone. Because uh, now they can't see the phone at all, they just see me talking. Uh, so, I wish I had my Bluetooth. Bluetooth of some sort. That's what I would do. I would just take Bluetooth on my ear, and then everyone would just think that I'm uh, on the phone. Which they should think I'm on the phone anyway. Uh, yeah. They keep looking up. So I keep looking back. Uh, but no, I'm gonna eat it, guys. Maybe I grabbed the granola bars because I didn't know what else to grab. So I grabbed some granola bars, and I was gonna eat them on the way here this morning. But then I forget. I forget I have things. I forget I'm doing things. I forget that I wanted to do things. Now that's funny. I wish. Oh no, he did it on purpose. Never mind. I thought he was throwing straps over off of those pallets, and I saw one just come where he was messing with it. He just come falling over to the other side, and I. Thought, thought that he had thrown it over to Gordon Walsh, but no, he did not touch. Uh, okay. So yeah, I'm here. I'm uh, through calcium propanate. Wasn't so much yet. Stood around for for about an hour. Stood around for about an hour doing nothing. Uh, then spent uh, about five minutes stacking calcium propanate. And then I stood around again for another 20 minutes. Uh, and then they walked us over to this other area. And there's nothing fast paced here whatsoever. I, uh, wonder if you see. I got, oh, I've got it up my nose. Uh, I didn't even notice that. I got something here that I have to wipe my mouth out. I had one, the calcium propanate I took on my shoulder. Powder went all over me. So this was the white stuff that is on me. And I was wondering things about it. Make sure. I mean, my nose is just. I got a, I'm sorry, the chair. If you're looking, I'm sorry. I don't know what. Fine enough. The nose. It's not boogers. I promise them. Or it's all went up in there. 
sorry, I'm sorry. I didn't realize that I tried to wipe it out already. It's just powder. All up in my nose, I didn't even realize it. Now I'm self conscious. Uh, baking, double, double acting baking powder. I've been doing that for, I guess, for maybe, maybe about an hour. I guess. I got here at 8.30, so, uh, yeah, probably, probably about an hour. But very slow. Uh, there's three of us. One guy brushes the bag off. Another guy has a glue gun and he glues uh, one or two of the seams. Then I grab the bag and stack it onto a new pallet. And it's slow, slow, fast pace. We're not rushing. We're just kind of taking it easy. So, that's what I've been doing. So I'm going to get off here now and eat this granola bar. I'm hungry. And, uh,. And I'm probably making another quick video at lunch. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to do for lunch. Uh, yeah. I took a picture. <laughs> I know this is a no no. But at Covidian, and I never got a picture at Covidian, but at Covidian, I, I had to wear a smock, which I, I think I've got one of those smocks. But uh, I had to wear this smock. I had to wear a uh, hairnet, a beard net, safety glasses. And I mean, the entire half of my upper half of my body was just covered. And I had to have gloves on, I had to have all this stuff, and I always wanted to have a picture taken of me in my my full battle gear. And uh but I took a quick picture. All I have here is my beard net, uh hair net and safety goggles. And I, I took a quick picture uh of me in there with it on so to actually see me in the factory. Oh, well, I'm gonna post it to Facebook. So uh anyways I'll catch you later.